Guys, it is time for the 21 2 million gold dueling tournament. It's kicking off right now. Mostly glad rank one players. Shuffle seeds. And now go to the brackets. And this is how it's looking. Round one. Teal versus Antox. Rhett versus Feral. Round two. Fox Sox versus Boyka. Oh, damn. Round four, Loveless versus Trend, Enaz versus Havoc. Round four, Sarox versus Big Mix. Five, Chris versus Pilly. Six, BDSF versus Swall, Havoc versus Rhett. Seven, Uga versus Slow, Windwalker versus MM. Eight, Offley versus Demo. First game, Rhett v. Farrell. I said like a matchup that I've tried quite a bit myself. Full air, oh no, okay. Short Maimer from Teal does get a clone off though. And gets the free frenzy. One problem in this now is like he can't clone into his own clone for the free frenzy anymore. Which could make this kinda kinda wonky. Thorns goes up. Man, Antox looking kinda scary here. Full main from Teal, Bop from Antox. Teal in some trouble, man. Pre-burst stun triggers anyways. I mean, with the region buffs, maybe we can, like, re recover a lot. I'm not quite sure how, how that's going to be. Heart is up, though. It's a bear on the blind. Let's see here. Full racing coming through. Antox still's bubble and lay on hands, though. Be quite, quite hard to kill through all those things, man. So, like, keep in mind, the UI bugs out sometimes. So, uh, like, you might be like, yo, he's not pressed whatever CD. But, but sometimes it's the uh, UI just bugs. And that's just kind of what it comes down to. So far, I mean, T looking fairly healthy. He still is, actually, I means no heart. He still is trink and, and, and no trinket, but he still is uh, renewal and wall. Okay, so Antok's bubble staring up. T with the pre-bear form on the Hodge. Antox actually struggling to, uh, to to get any pressure going here. Till back out. Omni bar. We could. We could. Maybe we should. After this game. Man, Teal is running around the pillar, dude. Antox not able to con to uh, connect too much. Sank is used. Tries to pre-sank something. We're just going around and around the pillar. Hodge on the teal. Full bash. I think it's like... It's looking rough for teal, but Trink's coming back up now soon. And Antox only has... Lay hands now to, to, to really press. This is Wings, though. And all of Wings has been cutted out. Rakes on onto Antox. Teal looking to close this out right now. Main coming through as well. Antox in big trouble. Lane has him blind. But Teal going for the kill. I think Antox will be going down, guys. In game one, Feral takes the W. I feel like Feral's a little harder to kill. Not after the region buff. Trinket blind instantly into a Hodge. Teal not force stringy though, but he does skin. Bear form region comes through. Thorns also used. The teal's just zooming around this pillar, man. Here we go. Mame. DR Rakesun, Bop has been forced, and Teal is back on the run. He's back on the run, man. Yeah, this is kind of rough for uh for, for Antox, guys. Full root, freedom. <laughs> Nerf region back? No, 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 no. I guess, like, like he, he needs to force Teal's trinket and then, like, you gotta get a big hodge and just kill him, but that's def definitely easier said than done. Teal also holding the uh, heart of the wild so far now. Mame coming through. 
Bubble has been forced. Okay, so here's a Hodge. He gets shrinked with a Hodge. And I guess on, on next Winx now, in a Hodge, in theory, that could be it. Let's see here. Thorns is up. Teal trying to fake, uh, fake casting clone, but it's not happening right now. Actually, guys, Teal on the runner in some trouble. There we go. Rake Sun is sank. He actually, wait, did he pre sank the Rake Sun? Good stuff there from, uh, from Antox. He's in trouble. There's no bubble, no nothing. Here we go. Hodge. Can this be it? Could this be the moment for Teal? I mean, for Antox. Blinds him with the final reckoning or whatever it's called. He's running in, guys. Teal. Low on HP. But next stun on Antox now is, is going to be brutal. Uh, he does have wings um, soon, I think. I, I think wings is like one of those seeds that, that, that is bugged. But wings should be up kind of soon again. I think. Teal is running, though, man. No tricking for 50 seconds for, from Teal. Like a wings hodge now, man, but he's cannot connect, dude. Teal is just zooming around. And, and, and he's no outs for the next stun, Antox. Or Teal, for, for, for that matter. But Teal's gonna, gonna get stealth. We're going in. This is dirty. I mean, he's playing it like a Feral, you know, should play it. Yep. I guess, like... Ooh, guys, Hodge, though. Here we go, Winx. Skin us up, though. Can Antox get some big damage out? Teal back on the run. Antox not really getting the uh, damage he was... Uh, he was hoping for there. In that Hodge. Here we go, Rake's done. Trinket blind coming through. Guys, wait. Hold up. This is kind of close right now. Both are dying, but... It seems like Antox will lose this, this exchange unless he has something to press, but he will go down Teal taking the first series 2-0. Series number two of round one of the tournament. We got Boyka versus Foxlax. Windwalker Monk versus Devastation. Let's see how, how this goes. I feel like definitely like you would think that, that, that Fox has this in, in, in the bag, but you never know. Moving in, here we go. Rub coming through. Fox with, with, with the in cap. Sweep. Boy, Katrina sweep. Tries to stun. Actually misses the stun on, on the Fox, though. And Fox is going in, man. Terminating right now. Holy smokes, guys. Fox is, is not messing up, uh, messing uh, uh, around. Boy, is getting ran down. He's pressing W on him. I'm not sure if Boyka can even do anything right now. Tries to get Orb up. Gets Orb up. Casts some heals, but TUD will land. Dude, Fox Sox just... No chill. Uh, so, Fox, after round one, like, how are you uh, feeling? Um, what did I tell you, huh? What, what? I told you? I you know what? Let's I just told not do you. this interview. No, let's just not do this interview. All right, guys, here we go. Fox Sox moving in. Boyka, ooh, gets knocked on Orb again. Not getting the orb up. Gets Trinket Sweep. Flies. Okay, Fox. Fox going all in. Karma as well, guys. Sleepwalk will connect. Fox has Trinket. is now the Karma Trinket. Everything has been used. If Boy can just live for a little bit of time now, maybe. Maybe you make it happen. But the, 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 the pressure from Fox is unreal, man. It is unfreaking real, dude. Kick on Disintegrate. Guys, Fox is actually in some trouble now, dude. Boyka's recovered. Semi-recovered. And Fox has nothing. They're both kind of like in the same boat with CDs, though. Here we go. Mounting up on that beautiful glad mount. Fox on the Raven Lord. Here we go. Move us in. Sweep us back. Sweep onto Boyka. We got Firebird back in five seconds. He's one wall. Maybe sleepwalk into Firebird something here. Could do it. He might die. Firebird stun coming through onto Fox Sox. Boyka surging. Oh my god. Guys, Boyka's not messing around now, dude. 
But Karma back in 20 seconds. That is not looking good for him. He's bringing it, though. He's, dr he's drinking up. He came prepared. All right. There we go. Mm, Karma back. Surrender back. This ain't good. In cap on a sleepwalk. Kick on a sleepwalk. Swim back in five seconds, dude. Can Boyka somehow do something here? But it's not looking good, guys. Dude, Boyka really showing up there, though. That was close, man. That was close. Guys, here we go. Big Mex versus Bebop. SB versus Survival. So who's going to be the uh, uh, aggressor? It seems like Bebop sort of push in. Big Mex staying really, really far back on the pillar. Chilling hard, but big damage from, from farm, man. Dude. Like, Big Mix does not need, need to be melee to do damage. It's not the pet. Well, it's just so many bombs and, like, you know, kill shots from far. Like, guys. Dude. Okay. Big Mix was never in melee range, but he just did the most damn. Game number three, Big Mix versus Bebob. Survival versus Shadow. Let's see how this goes, man. It's 1-1. One, one. This game decides who goes through. There we go. Pets on to Bebob. Steel Trap is down. He's kind of letting the, the, the pet adults do, do the work right now. Hey, Rusty's like howling, man. I've not heard him. Hey, Rusty boy. Guys, Big Man's going to die, though. Turtle 1%. I think he dies. Like, there's like no more healing to, to use. There's nothing else to really press. He is a feign death. Hey, Rusty. Yeah, I think he's calming down now. Hey, buddy. Guys, Big Mix is alive, but barely. Can he summon a little trap now? On to B-Bob. He's trying to ch chase him in. Camel's back soon. There's going to be some healing. He is alive, but... Pets on coming through air. Dispersion back in 20 seconds, guys. You can Big Mix somehow clutch this out. Sorry, this camera angle is pro probably not the best. Uh, Elon, 10 seconds. I mean, is there any way to do this? Like, the dispersion's back up. PI's back up, too. Sarah's shooting back in 20 seconds. Because Big Mix is recovering, though. He's playing this really safe now. He's going for the uh, the dampening approach. He's going for the dampening approach. That seems to be it. Which is probably what he has to do if, if, if he uh, wants to win. I mean, we're on 38% right now. Yeah, Bebop in some trouble. Dispersion coming through. PI up as well. Things are happening. Oh, wait, guys. Big Mix died. Guys, Bebop, Sarox will be taking out Big Mix. Okay, guys. Pilly, Tem Shield goes through. Like, Arkin is quite hard to kill, especially, you know, of the caliber that Pili is at. But Destro is, I mean, same. Same for Destro. Here we go. DB coming through. Full sheep. Mm, blinks in. Arkin, Arkin missiles coming through. Mm. Guys, Pilly, oh my god, has ice plug in like 1%. He will recover here, but this is looking kind of rough for Pilly, mate, guys. This was really, really close. He does recover fully, though. But will he be, be, be able to, to get the, the, the pressure out that that's needed to finish the game? Maybe like with some dampening. That could be it. Like right now, Pilly actually doing so much damage, guys. It seems like now it's happening. Hellsong comes through. Big heal. Reflect as well. 
Pilly blinking away. Okay, Chris Renashi, half HP end. I mean, should have a hard time to uh, recover now at this point. Bullfire. Does that be them? That's pretty be them. Your Tem Shield here should heal Pilly up a good amount. HB is super even. Ring of Fire, shifting power. Pilly in so much trouble though. He has Alter Time, but this is not looking good. Can he go back with? Did he get purged by like something? Damn, guys. So Chris does win game number one. Can Pilly bring it back now? Again, like you have to win this one. Like if you go 2-0 uh, down, you lose. Or 0-2 down rather, I guess. You're out. So it's a must-win scenario. More hype music? Dude, I got some hype songs uh, com coming up, okay? This playlist has some epic jammers in there. So Pity playing more aggro now from the start. Uh, get just getting more pressure out. For Chris's Hellstones. Right, let's do uh, this one. Here we go. Stopped on the ring. DB coming through. Full sheep. Guys, Pilly taking so much damage, man. Has to ice block. Dude. Chris is looking like unstoppable right now. Soulfire. Oh my god, that's big damage. Okay, alter though. Good alter value there. Can Pilly somehow re recover this? Is there any way, guys? It is GG. Dude, Chris looking super solid, man. Like, I've seen this matchup a few times now, and, and I, I, I've seen it go one way, but maybe Swaw can change that. BDSF is no joke, though, man. He's a big pumper. Here we go. Sun coming through. Hodge as well. Ooh, guys. We Swab doing the most damage right now, actually. Did Swab bring it out? Majorly. Wait. BDSF just healed himself. It's, it's, it's something lag is going on. I don't know what's happening, but... This is not normally. Here we go. Stun onto Swab. The bubble comes through. Means like BDSF held his trinket. He did hold his trinket. Which is big. Swa, no trinket, no bubble, so's Bob. But this could be problematic. Yeah, dude. That heal was huge, man. That heal was insane. There we go. Hodge onto uh, BDSF. Swatch trying to live this blur, by the way, now, too. Swatch trying to, like, run out the blur. Magic bump. Swap pushing in. Looking for a killer. Maybe melt from BDSF, guys. Wait, could this be it? Is Swat going to finish this right now? BDSF is super low. I don't think he has much healing. I mean, a little bit of healing, actually, apparently. He's still shrinking blur back in 20 seconds. Guys, Swas on the chase. Maybe he's gonna have to mount up or something. I'm not quite sure. Stun on the Swa. Big trouble ever swatting as the hunt. This is gonna be it. Unless Swa can bring out Leon Hands. Last moment, but he's he still a trinket. And Swa probably cannot heal this. This is dot. The hunt dot. And it will go down. Super, super close though. We got Trinket Blind coming through. Now, can Swa force Trinket on the first Hodge? If he can, it's huge, but... He just have to, doesn't have, have to press it, though. Okay, Magic Ball from Swa early on. Trying to push him with that and the wings. He, I mean, gets gets quite a bit of stuff for the Dark as well. But might be a bit overexposed now after this. I mean, shield as well going in with this. BDSF actually in big trouble, guys. Swash is going for the kill. 
On BDSF, is there any way you can live this? BDSF super low blurs used. Can Swa kill their blur? He gets a heal off. Hodge can Swa use lane. Oh, he does lane hands. Over bubble though, and that might actually cost him the game. It will cost him the game. Alright, guys. I mean, this is gonna be a, a, a matchup. I'm not quite sure who wins this or like who is favored. I'm not sure if if, if anyone is favored. Sniper shot though coming through. Big damage and Uga did. Oh my god, he has a burst is insane. Scatter shot, rapid fire, trust the lions, you can't come, but incap does go off before that happens. He turtles offensively. Maybe try to like turtle the karma. I'm not quite sure. Um but slow is not messing around, man. He's insane on the MM. Cutting back, trap on the Fist of Fury. Uga is like not really getting any uh pressure off. Can't really uh connect. He turtle sweep. I missed it, guys. Slow actually turtled the sweep. I, I didn't even see that. You're right. Slow is gaming. Sniper shot, but guys, Uga though actually also doing some damage now. But Uga tries to run super low on HP. Slow, no turtle. We used it to uh, to get the sweep, but uh, I, don't, I don't know if Uga lives this though. Oh my god, yo. Who could live this? He's trying to recover. The healing is not really there, though. Is it like a like instant heal or something? There we go. Or, or, or the, the castle one. Vivify. Yeah. Trap. Sniper shot. Is this the end? The sniper shot. Kill shot combination into rapid fire. Okay. It's over. Um. Yes, there we go. Game number two. Okay. Sniper shot. Rapid fire. Jeez, man. The 200k DPS opener. Okay, this time he, he uh, tricky sweep. Trap. Sniper shot again off the trap. He tricky karmas right before it goes off. Now Slobin Hood with the uh with the turtle hair. Rapid fire, aim shot, coming through. Double aim shot, dude. The damage just keeps on coming. But Uga now can he turn us around? There's no turtle, no tricky from from uh from slow. Is there like any way of like living to the next sweep? I don't even know. But next trap, sniper shot. It's not going to be good for him. Rapid fire coming through and he will die on the port, man. We got Bualok with the Mog. I don't know what's happening with this Transmog, man. But And then we got um Botify with the... Oh my god. Wait, sorry about the, the pub. I don't know what happened there. Uh, we got Botify on the Draenei Afli. Predictions, by the way. Oh, it's already been locked in. Yeah, hopefully you guys place those bets already. Yo, Adderall was good, man. Hey, yo, dude. Alright, so, I mean, in theory, if the Alpha gets big dots up and, like, lines, does he win? Maybe. I'm not quite sure. So far, though, Bua really putting on some pressure, man. And Botify, aka Goat, is on half HP and is dying to pets right now. This is not looking too hot. Trying to soul rot, but having a hard time getting it off. Wait, that was a big uh, health hellstone. Damn, that's kind of crazy. There we go. I have kill rog. Uh. Mm. Neither one really being able to, uh, to to cast now. Coilless each other at the same time. Oh my god. Okay, yo, goat, but though goat mommy uh, fakes the kick. Soul Rock coming through, doing it on the pet now. I guess you can like copy the, the, the dots and then spread them over, yeah? There we go. Drain Soul. Death Pack is up though. Yeah, Soul Burn. Yeah, true. It's a big heal. Guys, both. Both Death Packs as well. Okay, yeah, now the, the, the pressure's on Boom, man. He's kind of dying here. Big dots. Whoa, with the Hellstone. Big heal coming through. A red goat. There's like a quest line you can do. To get that. Boa, maybe looking to like some of the uh, seduction pet instead, it seems. I mean, it's kind of dying here. Kick on the fair. Emily coming through. Was well, getting rotted, man. Like, the damage is even, but the alpha is bringing out a lot more healing. And, uh, sustain. And I'm not sure Bua can deal with that, man. Is there any way? Super low on the HP, but there's no real recover here. Tries to get away with us on CD. 
And it seems like, you know, as as the game kind of goes on, it gets harder and harder for the deem for the Destro to win. But Alphalete can, like, just sustain for a lot longer. Which is huge in 1v1, right? It's massive. Nice, Rizu. That's good mana. Yes, there we go. Coil onto a uh, goat. It seems like maybe boys just go in there, just get on him somehow, and just do those case bolts to win this. Because if it, it, it's like like uh, a kiting game, he's gonna lose with adults. But I mean, doing that is is kind of hard. But he actually forced Waldo from um, goat now. The wall was forced. That's kind of big. That's kind of huge. Here we go. Case ball's coming through. Big damage. Double case ball. Triple case ball. Shadow Fury. Guys. Dude, Boa really, really putting on pressure now, man. Goat still has that Hellstone, though. Dark Lair's up. Be like this kind of uh, all-in uh, approach. Almost like melee approach. Just like run, run on top of them. Get a coil. Get a fair case ball. To do it. But he is taking damage well, though, and he's kind of falling. He's going down. Mm. Was wall up. Can he win here, dude? Can he just kill him? Is there any hope? Because he's low on HP. Like, this has to be it soon. The drain life, man. Bua. The dots. There's no recovery, you guys. Bua will be going down. To botify. So now, round two. This means first game, uh, the grand. Second game, loser picks the, picks the, the map. Still uh, BO3, though. I think Teal could definitely win this. But Fox is a big gamer. Wait, Fox is, is big gaming as well, man. Here we go. Huge opener from Teal, guys. Huge opener from Teal. Here we go. Sweep. Coming through. Teal triggers the sweep. Fox Sox guys in big trouble, man. He, he's holding karma. So here's the thing. Teal trinketed, right? Fox Sox did, did not trinket, but we got karma. We did get karma though. I'm saying we. As I'm I'm the feral, but or us ferals, but uh Yeah, karma has been forced. That's both trinkets. Uh, second sweep though, guys. Ten seconds. Okay, so Fox uses incap in now, which could be kind of rough for him. Second um setup. But Fox might just die. Fizzy Fury coming through. Can he live this, guys? I think Fox is going to go down. Fox will go down. He sweeps. Can he live? He will die. As he gets the sweep off. The Windwalker need, needs to win this one. Is his map pick on Tomb of... Uh, no, not Tomb. Runes of Lordaeron. 200 dollars. 200 gold, though. But yeah, close. Close. All right, guys. So the open hair is Teal's Trinket. Fox is going in. It's definitely a better map for him, right? Smaller map, and he's just getting a lot of uptime. Straight up. He's just getting a lot of uptime right now. Teal taking big damage. Feral wins. I think Feral can definitely do it. Mr. Fury, though, guys. Okay, Thorn. Wait, is that Thorns? No, no, skin. The ink card now, though, guys. Fox, no trinket. He does have karma. Okay, Teal won't be able to kill, but Karma coming through right now. Guys, next sweep in 10 seconds. This could be the end of Teal here. Uh, keep in mind, if, if Teal loses one, it's still 1-1, one, one, then it's Teal's map pick, right? It's so close, man. Guys, sweep is back in one. Can Fox Sox live? Who's going to get... Okay, the, it's over here for Teal. Incap sweep, surely, right? Okay. 1-1, one, one, guys. Fox Sox making it 1-1, one, one, and now it's Teal's map pick again. Denmark versus France, guys. Right here. Ooh, dude. Okay, actually, Foxes does trink it here for the big opener. Teal's gonna sit it though. Roar. The roar is nice in the monkeys. You can roar fist. Okay, I don't know what's going on. It looks a bit laggy. Fox is com committing a lot right now and actually not getting that much. I would say this. Uh, the the heart double region is pretty huge. Guys, yeah, stun on the fox now. The will fox is dying in this in the stun chain. He has karma, but. Lined. 
The bleeds shouldn't really be doing all that much to Fox right now. Should be fine. So there's the thing. Teal has trinket though yet still now, right? Last game, we trained the opener. Oof. Roar. Guys, Fox Ox is looking a little bit rough right now. He does have karma, but I mean, if he gets stunned right now, he might not even get it off in time. He will. That's a Feral Frenzy root now onto uh, Fox. There we go. Sweep. This should be Teal's Trinket, right? Surely. Actually, maybe not, guys. Teal's holding Trinket. Karma's used, but... You, ooh. He Karma's into the, the, the Thorns, right? So this could be some trouble for Teal here. Not really. Okay, so Fox is live, live lording the guys. Trinket back in... in, in uh, 25 seconds, man. I mean, if he gets shrink it back, surrender it back. This could be something. It's a pretty even game right now. Here we go. Rake Sun coming through. So this is like one thing that I found when I dueled Windwalker and Feral. If the game goes long, it's really hard to actually finish. And this is why I went Convoke. Because uh, it can be really hard to actually close the game. I think for both players, or like both uh, specs, but yeah. Yes, Fox has Trinket again. Thorns is up there, though. And Fox has no Trinket, no Karma. But can he live? The Incap. The Rope. Just cutting it out. Mame comes through. DR Ray comes through as well. Here we go. Fist of Fury. Oh my god, guys. Fox. Oh, Karma comes back, though. Just in time. The Karma comes back. This is so damn close. Guys, sweep us back soon. But is it going to be back soon enough? It doesn't seem like an Incarn comes back. And what a game. Yo, what up, uh, fake Mijo? Okay, guys. Here we go. B-Bulb. I said here we go like four times. Uh, here we go. Stuck. <laughs> I said it again. Freak. Let's go. That's better. SP versus DH. Void Torrent coming through. Instantly fake cast, actually. The hunt coming through now, too, though. <laughs> Here we go. Yeah, Sarox. Can he do it, man? I mean, this is going to be some crazy pressure to live, though. It's going to be some insane pressure to try and live. Trent is going in. He's pressing W. And what was that hit? Wait, was that Desperate Prayer fading? That's what it was. Desperate Prayer faded. And I guess Trent got a big hit at the same time. Guys, here we go. Game number two. We're now Crucible. Trent versus Sarox. Can Sarox make it happen on a bigger map? Bigger pillar? I don't know. Here we go. Trinket has been used. Dispersion. I think it faked the hunt. No, okay. I actually did send it through. It did happen. Wait, I beam. Wait, hold up. Was that going over there? Wait, what was even going on? Sarox can soon fare again, but will it be it? He's stunned. No out for the stun. Might just die. Deej tries to uh, glimpse that fare, but he does get the fare eventually here. Mike is coming through. Here we go. Stun. Void Torrents. Guys, it's close. The Sarox is kind of doing it, man. Dispersion has been used. Trent is falling really, really low. We go fair, guys. No trinket for, for, for Trent. Could this be it? VT. Guys, Trent. 2% HP, 1% or something like this. He's so low, but he gets a big heal off. Bebop with a fade. There's a root. I think that the root got, got a glimpse or something, and he will go down, dude. That was so close. That was so freaking close, man. Chris versus BDSF. GG. Destro versus Havoc. I mean, Chris is an absolute insane gamer on the uh, Destro, man. 1945. Damn.
I respect that. There we go. Shadow Fury coming through, guys. Yo, BDS is taking big damage here, man. This is not looking good from the Chris. Chris is pumping. Dude, that's a cool mod, by the way. Fair comes through. Soul fire. Does it go off? Or will the fair line it behind the pillar? No, it goes off. Big damage. Boom. Wait. Nether walk. That's what it was. I mean, Chris is looking really, really solid here, guys. It's uh, hard. Seems. Deathback's back up. He's a coil too. There we go. Coil coming through into Shadow Fury, into Immolates. Fair again, dude. Incinerating. BDSF is dying, guys. Can he live this? There's nothing for him, really. Glimpse. Ooh, gets a big heal off. But does not seem like he can stay alive. There's darkness. Will that do the trick, though? I mean, he's kind of like staying alive with the, with the heals, the small heals here and there. Succubus is on him, too. The Sleepwalk, Soulfire, and with that, BDSF will be going down. You guys, Chrisser making it 1-0. A rookie tournament could be really fun. The question is then, like, how rookie do we make it? This is like, you can't join if you've been rival, like challengers only, or do we do just non-glads or, you know. Yodornik, thank you, man. Thank you, dude. Max one glad. But like then we're basically kind of... I think it, it could be fun like doing one... Um, like combatants only, man. That could be fun. Anyone below Uga CR only, yeah. Guys, Chris, man. He is not messing around. I swear, Chris is so crazy at this game. And like, you know, you have rank one players, right? That don't really one one Then you have rank one players who do one one That is Chris. He does one ones a lot. Like, he's joined uh, da uh, the Dalaran War Games a bit. And uh, he just knows how to play it in the one one situation. You guys, BDSF will go down. Chris moving through. There we go. Sniper shot coming through. It does land. Rapid fire. Huge pressure. Instant health on here. Shadow Fury. Into a full fair. Soul right now. You got slow and trouble, man. The thing is, like, once the, the, the dots are up, they're going to stay up. For the most part. Guys. Slow will be going down. He will be going down. This, this is the, the thing. Like, if you don't have that sustain, like, if you're, and if you're facing a spec that has it, you're going to be in big trouble, like, after a minute, you know? Can he find the, uh... Sniper shot opener. Can indeed. Here we go. Sniper shot coming through. Rap fire. The dot hits instantly, though. Here we go. Coil does land. The UA does not really force anything here. Hold up now. Death Pact and Hellstone. It's a pretty clean mog, man. This does seem tough, yeah. That's for sure. Slow, trying to run. Coil, he's stealth, though, in the coil, but gets Shadow Fury'd out, though, man. That's going to get him right out of stealth instantly. Turtle has been used, canceled Rapid Fire. Man, like... Oh, he's playing the, 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 the wall hack thing. Yo, Nuni, do you, do you need more gold now? Oh, shoot, guys, slow. He will be going down, it looks like, and damn, on the mount up. Guys, Botify is not messing around today. We got Teal versus Trend and Chris versus Body. In the finals is best of five. So semifinals and, and grand finals are both BO5. Is stun, I beam onto Teal, instant roar. Instant roar onto Trend. The trend is going ham, guys. Instantly trinkets too. He's still gonna like, try to play like a really uh like the, the the long game, you know, kite a lot. Try live, but man, the problem is like killing a DH is a lot easier said than done. 
I feel like maybe this matchup, like, Convoke could be something. Here we go. Pre-Dark from Tren. Doesn't really get anything, though. Kick coming through. Here we go. Main... Oh, dude. Pre-Netherwalk from Tren. He's playing, like, really, really, um... Like, pre. He's, like, pre and everything, basically. Which, which is good to do. But it can come back to bite him. If it doesn't finish early, you know, from actually just pressing everything. Here we go. Roar on the trend. The teal is just stuck in bear form mana. Oof. The pressure's unreal, dude. The pressure's unfreaking real. He's having a hard time, like, getting stuff going. Like, Teal is yet to, like, really do a go. But, with that being said, I mean, Trend does have no trinket. So, just one clean go could be devastating for, uh, for, for Trend. Yo, Super Mega T-Rex with the two months. Thanks so much, man. Thank you, dude. Guys, Teal taking big damage here, man. Holy smokes. DR main coming through as well. Just jumping away, trying to live. But, is there any hope? Is there any hope? Trend is moving in like an absolute Terminator. Just locking in. Here we go. The hunt. Decree and everything. And guys, Teal will probably go down here. He will be going down. There we go. Pre-bear from Teal. So guys, it's BO5, which means that, that the Teal, you know, if if he um if he go go 2 0 down, he can still come back. But you know, it's hard. Hard to do. It seems like he's playing Thorns now. What's not playing that first game? Pre-Dark from Trend. Dude, I swear. Guys, into DH. I feel like it might be a Convoke angle. But as I'm saying this, though, Trend is going down. Yeah, Tail. Sorry. He streams. He does. Yeah. I think he's Twitch or TV slash Tay. No, T-A-A-E-E-L. I believe it's that. Guys, wait. This round, he, he's, he's making it happen here. Guys, Trend will be going down in game number two. And Tail making it 1-1. One, one. Guys, game number three is a 1-1 one, one so far. Here we go. Roar. Ooh, dude. Roar the, the Roar clone the blur. Huge value there from uh from Teal. From, from Tail. Going again. There we go. He glimpsed. Did he glimpse the meme there? I think he might have. Wait. Did he glimpse it? There was a, a race on here, so I believe he did glimpse the meme. Guys, Teal. Big trouble. Big trouble here. Trent is just going in. Just doing the most damage. Stun on Teal here. Decree coming through. Darkness pre-dark to maim. Huge pre-dark. Eye beam. The hunt now, guys. Okay, this is un unlivable, I think. Unless, yeah. Guys, 2-1. 2-1. For Tren. Teal needs to win this game. If not, he's out. And Tren is going to move into the, the grand final of the tournament. Yeah, we don't have that far more. Feels bad. Get Teal with a decent go, it seems. Get, gets a root on. Gets imprisoned. Fair. Here we go. The hunt. Stun. Teal trinkets. He's not playing Convoke. Yeah, he got it ready. Wait, is Teal DC'd? It seems like Teal DC'd in the very end. I, th I think uh, Trend was looking really strong there as well. Maybe Teal could have brought it back. Is GG anyway? Maybe it was. Yo, dude, Teal. GG's, man. Dude, I mean, Tail. Hosting, guys. Here we go. Offley versus Destro. Second matchup. Yo, Eduartha. I appreciate that, Eduartha. <laughs> Double or nothing the winner. No, no man. Here we go, guys. Can, if any Destro can do it, it's probably Chris. What if the fake kick gets a precog? Shadow Free Lance, guys. Bonzo fell. Goat could be in some trouble here, man. 
Hellstone has been used. Tops himself. Both Hellstones have been used. I think this is like basically what the Destro has to do. It really just be on top of it, right? He's feeling the pain. Because he can't really recover this. Like, there's nothing to really do for a rec recovery for him. Um, can purge it? That's true, that's true, right? But I guess the uptime is high in it. Soul fire. It does go off. Yo, I love my cat. Welcome. Yes, Chris. Can he do it in the end here? Bonza fell. Ports away. The coil and Chris will go down, guys. Goat. 1-0, oh, dude. Yes, Goat, is is he about to move into the grand final? Can Chris do it? Is 1-0 oh for body? I mean, he has to win this one, really. He's holding his heels. Fair. Guys, Observer 2 now. Big damage coming through here. But Drain Soul. And Botify mana. He's making it happen. Actually... Chris kills him. I spaced out in the end there. Wait. Maybe I, I thought like the other world was low. But Chris does take him out. Making it a 1-1 one, one on a hook point, guys. So fire. Guys, wall death pack coming out from Botify. Death pack from Chris too. Here we go. Do, do, do. Sounds, sounds a bit loud, maybe. Yeah, I turned down a little bit. Soul fire, dude. Honestly, I have no idea. It seems like a case bolt, but like a little bit bigger. I don't even know, man. But it, it does big damn. I'm not even sure if there's a path to uh, recovery here. I mean, Oblivion is on. No, I mean, um, what's it called? Little pet thing. Guys, coil. Shadow Fury. Cruise the big damage here. Fair. Immolates. Case bolt coming through, too. Is there any way he can live this, though? He's super low on HP. Incinerate. Does he have some big bursts in the end there? Coil coming through. Drain life. And that will surely be the end of Chris. Or unless... Meld. He melts for a moment. He's still alive. He's no HP. What is going on? He does die. Okay. It seems like Botify is locking in right now. He, he, he's just zoning in. Locking in. Doing the big damn. Being very tanky. Full dots up. But, I mean, Chris, can he do it? Shadow Free coming through. Coil now. Oh, my God. The score, it's 2-1 it, it's for um, Botify. 2-1. Guys, Chris in big trouble, man. Gateway right there. Coil. Go. Just so much HP, man. This is nothing to really do. He's going to go down. And Botify, guys, is now... In the grand final. And he's going to face off. Against Tren. Grand finals. Havoc versus DH. Who do I think is going to win? Dude, I can't really say. You know, I'm an unbiased uh, commentator. Wait, is it Havoc versus DH? Alfley versus DH. Alfley versus Havoc. Hmm, guys, this is wall death pack. Trent just waits out the whole wall. Ooh, nice fake kick there from Botify, though. Huge gaming. Here we go. In again. Stun. Death pack is through. Tries to fair. Gets stun on the fair. Tries to drain life. There's nothing else to really do right now. I guess you can maybe kite soon, but gets a decent shield from that. Tries to fair again. Full fair lands, but man... Trend is just looking unstoppable. Fakes kick again. The drain life is just not going to do enough. Ports away again. I mean, in the end, there, things are kind of happening. Gateway, Trend half HP. Shadow Fury is glimpsed. Legion of Creed misses, but he will be going down, guys. Botify having a hard time. Just cutting out. Like la last game, Wall was kind of like he got Wall and then Trend just bounced. Here we go. Wall now. Fair. Glimpse on fair. Man. Dude, glimpse is so annoying. 
Glimpse is the most annoying thing, I swear. Like, when I fa face a DH and, like, they, they, they glimpse something, or it's like, you fake kick, and then they uh, clone, and then they glimpse your clone, it's like, dude. It's so smash. Here we go. Shadow Free comes through. Soul Roy has big dots there, man, from uh, Goats. Huge dots. Oh my. Okay, so actually, big heal for big healer from Trend. Coil now, Haunt coming through. Guys, Butterfly looking way more solid now, man. A huge dots rub too. Drain life. Get stunned. The Hunt now, though. Big damage from Trend. Can Butterfly live this? It's taking a lot of damage, man. Death Bite is up. Fair. The fair lands, guys. And Trend is super low on HP, man. Butterfly. Going for the kill. Netherwalk is up. Haunt replies it. Never mind. Drain life comes through. Darkness has been dropped down now. Can Botify some? I live this trend is super low. I guess trend will go down in game number two. Botify making it a 1-1. One, one. Dude. Very important game there. If, if Botify can win this one on Trend's map pick, that's huge. Your coil. Fair. Trinket from uh, Trainer now. Haunt coming through. Fair. He does have the precog. First place gets 1.2 million gold. The hunt goes through, guys. Big damage here. Onto Goat. Drain life. Try fakes him again, guys. Huge fake casting here from Goat. Blurs up now. It seems like uh, re reverse was used. UA instantly reapply the two. Haunt now. Ooh, Netherwalk, man. Pre-Netherwalk on the Shadow Free here from Tren. Well done there. <clears throat> it's done. Just kick. Fix him again, guys. The GOAT is getting a lot of pre cogs He's the GOAT with getting pre cogs But it maybe won't even matter, though. Tren is going in right now. Big trouble from GOAT. He does have a death back. Wait, pre cog again? Guys, GOAT... Can he do this? He's free casting the, the, the drain life. Gets a big shield. That's why he's C of the age. S <laughs> with the ages. Hold up. Guys. He's super low, man. But refair. Drain life coming through. Go looking for a little shield now with the drain life. Haunt coming through as well. Trent is super low. Can he live? But go. He's dying though. It's nothing to press really. So drain soul. Anything to do. He pours away. They're both so low. I didn't even see who died. Guys, Trend died. Botify won the game. Botify going in. Port coming down. Circle coming down too. Gets stunned. He's on the Love Rocket too. Still on, on the mount. Wait, he melts coil, guys. Trend melts the coil. That is really, really tough. Um, would you be the one one? I don't know. No idea. No idea. I mean, I'm, I'm pretty old. I'm pretty washed up, you know. It's a caster, novice. I'm all about casting. I'm not really about, you know, one and one Yeah. Ren is pumping, man. That that meld was sick. That soul rot. Hell's on here coming through. Trent is present W right now on him, man. Dub time is high. Coil. Does land a fair. Fair again. Haunt goes through. Hold up, guys. There's the uh, reverse. Soul right now. Guys, wait. Trend could be in trouble here, man. Soul Rot's up. Ports away. He's cutting it super nicely here, man. Can Trend do this? He's super low, though. The hunt coming through. That's going to do some, some, some good healing as well, I guess. Netherwalk is used. Both of them. Quite low right now. The coil lands, guys. Full fair into the eye as well. It's going to do even more damage. And Botify 
Goes for the kill. And Botify, aka Goat Mommy. Uh, will win the whole thing. The whole tournament. 1.2 million gold. Trendo gets 500k gold. Also pretty good. But uh, guys, Botify, man. The one and only dude. Uh, com comes through. And he just wins the tournament.